Hey guys, it is June the 22nd of 2018 and uh, I'm out on the road and I wanted to do a quick video. been thinking about this and I wanted to share some uh, insights. I think if you are a GANist and you use GAN theory for trading, whatever you trade, I think and I believe and I recommend and I advise that you learn you pick up uh, machine learning, artificial intelligence to help you with your trading system. GANS theory is difficult. It's not easy. The more you continue backtesting and using it and practice and explore, different techniques and experiment the more you realize that things work things doesn't work things are connected with other things that Gan spoke about and you just keep growing and learning uh, vice versa with machine learning the machine is also growing and learning together with you um, and artificial intelligence. So the future to, for trading, in my opinion, is using the theories you have learned or you are learning, the GAN theories, and using machine learning, artificial intelligence to help you, to be your partner, to analyze data together with you and this is why I wanted to do this uh, it's a short video uh, and I called it I didn't call it the future but it's pretty much GAN theory machine learning and artificial intelligence that is the latest trend uh, right now everyone is learning this because the future is about data it's about uh, information decoding it and that applies to the same thing when you're trading the forex or the uh, stocks or the indices the futures you're getting all the data you can get you're trying to find a pattern you're trying to get an edge and you're trying to make a buck a day pretty much so if you can find an edge in the market with low risk that is the end game to make money uh, the difficulties we have right now is that you are competing against the best machines in the world. I mean, look at Watson from IBM. That thing reads millions of pages in seconds. I mean, this is the kind of stuff you're dealing against hedge funds that have spent millions of dollars on systems like this that have no emotions and no feelings and find patterns and you know trades them you're dealing with the best traders in the world that are programming and using algos to execute trades to get an edge you use there you're competing with with uh, companies and banks and hedge funds where it's all about speed it's about getting the fastest transaction the speed of light to get ahead of you and make a penny or a buck a day from every transaction so the competition is fierce you're dealing with quants you're dealing with mathematicians I mean you're dealing with a pool of sharks they got all kinds of tools And today in this age, you just can't depend and trade just on the GAN theory. You're going to need a little help. These other guys are not using, they may be using GAN theory, I'm not going to rule it out. But they're using some heavy duty machine that could break things down in patterns and find something that could give them an edge. 
being successful or not, they're trying to get an edge to make some money. And I believe that the future will be to be trading and having your buddy, your partner being a robot, software, whatever you want to call it, helping you, helping you find some patterns, uh, doing statistics and an analysis to find these patterns for you to make a buck. I'm going to show you some things where it could be uh, helpful in that. There's a YouTube video um, called Machine Learning for Algorithmic Trading Part 1, Machine Learning and First Steps. This is from uh, Quant News. Let me mute that. And I'll probably put the links if I have some time. But you could just look, type that phrase and it should show up from Quant News. That's the YouTube site. I recommend you get start getting the lingo of you know machine learning for for uh, trading. Um, uh, I'm not part of this team. I don't know these guys. You know I'm not getting paid. I'm just showing you stuff that you know I research because I'm a researcher first of all. I'm always curious. I'm always looking. I'm trying to learn new things every single day. I'm trying to learn something. Knowledge is information. And the more you know, the better you're off. Uh, I don't know if this is just one video. I just watched this video today and it was pretty interesting. Uh, but this is kind of the things you need to be looking and, and learning and just kind of get your ears wet and just trying to, you know, get that lingo. Uh, another place you could go, uh, it's uh, Timing Solutions. This is a software I use for uh, my forecasting. Uh, one of them because I used a couple other ones too. Um, good software. Uh, it caters more to like the GAN uh, side of trading, esoteric trading, mathematics, a little bit of everything. But it's a great software. I recommend it. Once again, I'm not being, you know, compensated by these people or not. I, I don't know any of them. I don't know the owner. I just know that they got some good stuff there to help you with your trades, to do your analysis and your research, to come to uh, better conclusions and probability in your favor. Uh, in regards to uh, software for, for data science and, and breaking down patterns, this is a software that's pretty cool. I have it, Rapid Miner. Um, and this kind of one is more like drop, drop and drag. It's really, you could probably do some coding here and there, uh, but it's not really coding intense. It's more about drop and dragging things and working on models. Um, so it's, it's, pretty, it's pretty good. It gives you some breakdowns. You can watch the videos. What I want to do is I want to get you to, you know, just get out of your comfort zone and learn what the future is, 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 is going to happen, what, what's coming. The future is, this is the future. Robots. I mean, they're going to, you're going to see them more on the street. You're going to see them more when you, you know, you're going to deal with them more when you call places. Um, when you go, <laughs> it's just, it's just a matter of time. You're going to be seeing a lot of robots. Uh, another uh, program you may want to learn is Python. Uh, uh, programming language. Uh, they say it's one of the top uh, things to learn in regards to uh, uh, machine learning. Another program is called R, Language R, uh, for statistical computing. Uh, this is another program that you could, you know, you could look up, Language R. This is a course I'm taking called Fast AI. Uh, they train you about, you know, deep learning and um, videos and, and it, it, it goes through to hands-on so if you don't know anything you know maybe you got a little bit of coding experience that's fine if you don't it's fine too they'll they'll they go over this video and they kind of teach you uh, you know today we will start an object detection so kind of the things that you know 
if you use Facebook, you know, when you tag your picture, it kind of recognizes you automatically and all that kind of stuff. So these are the kind of things you will learn, but, you know, it's good to get an all-around basis around all this stuff. So like that, when you start applying it to your trading strategies and everything, you have some tools. Because these are this is what the big boys and the big banks and the hedge funds and everyone else are using. And you don't want to be left behind. Machine learning software, you can see that there's a bunch. TensorFlow, Google, Weka, Apache, Torch, PyTorch. You know, the list goes on. Uh, Deep Learning 4J, uh, MLPAC, RapidMiner. I mean, it's just so many. You can see. I know it's overwhelming, but I'm just kind of wetting your ears. Intelligent Software. These are some that you could you, know, you could check out. Sensi, Grow, Tableau. You can see uh, Data Analysis, Data Visualization. So there's all kinds of stuff you can look um different things you could you could test uh and just kind of mess around uh books you could probably find uh this is um machine learning and data science uh, over here it shows you top job postings and popular languages is python r java javascript c c++ um, data program languages for top eight Python, Java, R, C, 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 JavaScript, Scala, Julia. Um, so you can see, oh, look at that guy, no joke. So Python and R are prominent in the top three due to their easy learning curve. So you see, those are the kind of things you need to like start looking at. And that's this other website called KD Nuggets. Um, same thing, just showing you all the languages and stuff like that. So you could decide which one you want to pick, Python or R or Java. You know, I'll let you decide. I'll tell you which one to pick. And then you could just kind of learn something new. And then once you get really good, you can incorporate it in your, uh, in your training, trading and you could test some things out and be like a researcher you know be like a researcher learning things uh, but the key is to use GANs theory machine learning and artificial intelligence this is going to be a helping guide once you know the GAN theory and this is on ongoing basis this is all your life you're going to be learning this stuff and learning new things and applying new things this is going to help you find patterns um, and patterns in the data because there is patterns in the data you just gotta figure it out um, so that's my my thoughts that's my presentation just wanna because that's what I'm doing I'm applying these three all together now this is the new challenge for my life right now this right here machine learning and artificial intelligence this is the future this is already what's been established and this is a learning progress this is your whole life just learning and applying and testing and seeing things work things didn't work and just just learning uh, and getting better getting better at forecasting this is gonna help you with this GAN theory it's gonna confirm things um, and then it's going to give you probabilities, you know, uh, to trade uh, higher probabilities uh, and get better, get better trades. I'm going to sign out. Hope you like this video, and I'll keep you posted on my thoughts.